In recent weeks, I've been tagged in a bunch of posts regarding dirt tracks being listed for sale. And right now we know that there are active listings for Tri-City and Knox in Pennsylvania and Stateline Speedway in New York. There's also been a bunch of social media chatter this week about Sharon Speedway in Ohio. Looking at LoopNet, there is a listing there for Sharon with a price tag of $3 million. I've been alerted to several of these posts, but I don't think I'd be concerned about this one. If you dig into the listing a little bit, it was first put up way back in 2018. I mean, that's five years ago. And the original broker for the property for that listing doesn't even exist anymore. It's been absorbed by another brokerage company. And I did do some asking around to get some more information and to see what was up. And I was told by someone close to the track that a sale is not currently actively being pursued. I think it's important to remember that everything is probably for sale at the right price, but, but at this moment, I wouldn't be worried about the future for Sharon Speedway.